All right, establish the following identity. Cosecant of theta minus the cotangent of theta equals sine beta over one plus cosine theta. All right, remember the process. Start with one side, do some work, end up with the other side. You really could start with that side if you wanted and try some, um, apply some identities, maybe some algebra, and end up with this side. You can go either way. Just don't do work here and work here. Okay, we don't want to do that. We want to start with one side and end up with the other. Alright, so I'm going to start this left hand side. Let me draw a line here. Alright, those are the directions. That's not any of the work. Right? That's what they're asking to be established, or what I'm asking to be established. These two are the same thing. So I'm going to start with this side. And I'm going to say equals the cosecant of theta minus the cotangent of theta equals. I'm going to write that because I don't know that. Right? I'm trying to show that. So I'm going to do some work and see if I can end up with that. All right, so what's, again, what's the first step in this example? The only identity, the only thing I can think of to do would be to apply the reciprocal identity here and the quotient identity here. I'll show you why. So this is equal to, come down here, 1 over sine. That's all I can really do with that, right? This I can do 1 over the tangent of theta, or I can apply its quotient identity, which is cosine theta over sine theta. Which is what I think I want to do, because I got a denominator here that's sine theta, right? So that's the direction I want to go in. Okay? If I would have went 1 over tangent theta, I'm not going to really be able to get anywhere. Okay, maybe in another direction, but I think this is probably the best. Alright? Now, what's next? The logical thing to do, I think, would be to subtract this from this common denominator. Let me write it over here is the sine of theta, right, making the numerator 1 minus cosine theta. Okay? But remember, it looks similar to that, but it's not what I'm trying to show. I need to show that this equals this, okay, which I don't have yet. So somehow I have to end up with sine theta 1 plus cosine theta, okay? So this is the step that's a little tricky. Um, and you get this really with experience. With doing a lot of these, you, you, you'll, you'll recognize to try this every now and then. I know if I multiply the top by 1 plus cosine theta, it should give me 1 minus cosine squared theta, which there's an identity for. Okay, so that, why 1 plus cosine theta? Well, there's two reasons. If I multiply that, I'll get 1, 1 minus cosine squared, which there's an identity for. I know there's another trig function that's equivalent to that. And I also can see this shows up in my answer. I know it's supposed to end up with a 1 plus cosine theta in the denominator, so... Multiply the numerator and the denominator by that and see what you get. All right? So let's see what happens. The top will be 1 minus cosine squared theta. And then on the bottom, well, I'm just going to leave it. I'm not going to multiply it through. Let's see why. All right, I'm not going to multiply that sine theta through because I can see that I want this as part of my answer. Right? We can use what's given. We don't want to start with that on that right-hand side. We can look and say, I've got to end up there. I need a 1 plus cos of theta, my denominator. Well, I got that. Right? With what did I do? I applied an identity. I subtracted and I multiplied by 1. Right? That didn't change any of the problem, didn't change anything. Um, and now if I can apply one identity here, my Pythagorean identity, 1 mi minus cosine squared theta sine squared theta down here. I got sine squared theta over sine theta times 1 plus cosine theta. Let me start a new board. Sine squared theta over Okay, and I'm almost there. I'm almost there. You might be able to see the cancellation for the final answer. I got sine theta times sine theta. I got sine theta here, so one of these will cancel out with this. Right, and that'll just be sine theta.
And that's what we were trying to show. Okay?